Vaccination routine wellness. Parvo is nearly 100% preventable, but we still see tons of puppies dying from it. So make sure that if you get a pet, if you're a new pet owner, that you get in touch with one of the family vets right away and you make sure that you're on the right schedule so that the little guys will receive all of their immunizations and deworming so that they don't become sick from preventable infectious diseases. Parvo, the canine parvo virus, so the one that we vaccinate all the puppies for, that was a new virus. It emerged in the late 1970s in dogs that had never been seen before. It's thought that it mutated from the feline parvovirus, which causes panleukopenia. And I guess three genetic mutations and boom, canine parvovirus. My mentors that were practicing in the 80s coming out of vet school, they said that when they first started practicing, all they just remember was puppies dying everywhere. It's a puppy killer virus. And it killed puppies in epidemic proportions all throughout the 80s until a really good vaccine was developed. And now the vaccine is so good, it's nearly 100% preventable with proper vaccination. But that said, we still see lots of patients coming in dying from parvo. These are puppies, little puppies. It's preventable and super hard to treat, expensive. There's no cure for it. And so that's why it's so important. If you have a puppy, they say an ounce of prevention is worth a pound of cure. Parvo is the perfect example of that. Getting your puppy the routine vaccination starting at eight weeks on the dot. Maybe a puppy, they should be at the vet at eight weeks, not a day later, and getting their routine vaccinations every three to four weeks until they're at least 16 weeks old. And that's to protect them from diseases like parvo because if they acquire it, the cost of treating it is at least 10 times the cost of preventing it, and there's no guarantee of survival, and it's a lot of suffering to go through.